HeidiTown.com. Colorado festivals and events that are Heidi Town Mayor approved. Visit this town and you'll never be bored again. Hi, my name is Heidi and I'm the mayor of HeidiTown.com, a blog about events, festivals, and road trips around Colorado. Here's the lineup for Friday, October 7th through Sunday, October 9th, 2011. It's October and that means haunted houses and ghost walks. To be honest, I'm a complete wimp when it comes to haunted houses. I'm more of a fan of ghost tours, and one of the best I've been on was right here in Fort Collins. This city is a treasure trove of ghosts and murder stories. There are other great ghost tours around Colorado, including the famous Evergreen Cemetery Tour with Judge Neil Reynolds in Leadville. Other tours occur in Longmont, Golden, all over Denver, and in most of the mountain towns, such as Breckenridge and Blackhawk. There's likely a tour in your favorite Colorado town. If you aren't a wimp like me, it's not hard to find a haunted house in Colorado during the month of October. In Fort Collins, Scream Theme Studios always gets high praise for their Battle of the Haunted Houses. This husband and wife team each gets a stab at creating a haunted experience, and then the public votes on which was their favorite. The battle has already begun at Foothills Mall in Fort Collins. Find it online at ScreamTheme.com. For horror film enthusiasts, check out the Mile High Horror Film Festival at Stars Film Center Tivoli Theater this Friday through Saturday. On the schedule, 30 horror films from over 11 different countries. Get all the gory details at milehighhorrorfestival.com. If corn mazes and fall festivals are more your style, you're in luck. On Saturday, it's the 15th annual Festival of Scarecrows in Arvada, Colorado. A super kid-friendly event, there will be a cornstalk maze, face painting, train rides, games, a parade, and hay rides. Parents can learn more at arvada.org. Look under Arts and Culture. The Firestone Fall Festival is also on Saturday from 11 to 4 p.m. Held at the Firestone Regional Sports Complex, there will be a pumpkin hunt, scarecrow games, a petting zoo, live music, and more. There's also a Harvest Festival and Pumpkin Sale at the Littleton Historical Museum this weekend. From cider to games to picking out the perfect pumpkin, this is another family-friendly festival. More at littletongov.org backslash museum. Want to watch some pumpkins fly? Head to the Arapahoe County Fairgrounds on Saturday for the Pumpkin Chunkin Colorado, formerly the Jacko Launch at Pumpkin Fest. Teams and individuals will compete to see how far they can make a pumpkin fly. Learn more at auroragov.org. For history buffs, this Thursday through Sunday is the Durango Heritage Celebration. This is an event that will educate and entertain. Visit durangoheritagecelebration.org for information. In Grand Junction, it's the Colorado West Marching Band Festival. The parade will be held Saturday at 10 a.m. in downtown and the field show begins at 1 p.m. at Stalker Stadium. More at visitgrandjunction.com. Last but not least, for those of you who enjoy shopping a little early for the holidays, the Greeley Tribune Craft and Gift Show is this weekend at the Island Grove Regional Park. More at greeleytribune.com. That's all for this week. Remember to follow me on Twitter at HeidiTown, and be sure to join the town's block party on Facebook at HeidiTown.com on FB. Thanks for listening. Well, that's today's segment. Any questions or comments, contact our Mayor Heidi at HeidiTown.com.